So here I have the NVIDIA Jetson AGX Orin. Um, and this is a, a computer, which is like, it's a GPU, which is specialized for like machine learning and AI. So if we open it up, um, you can see inside there's a computer. Um, and it's very, it's very, very heavy. Um, but actually most of this is from like the fan because the fan is like this whole gray part and then it's only like the circuitry down here. Um, and so we can see what the ports are, which is there's a USB-C and a 40 pin and then two USB-A. And then on this side, we have three buttons and micro SD. And then on this side, we have barrel jack, USB-C, Ethernet, two USB-A, display port. And then this display port is interesting because um, a lot of computers, they don't have display port. So uh, you can buy one of these along with it. And it's a display port um, to, to it, it's, a, it's a, yeah, it's a display port HDMI um, adapter. Um, and uh, here we have another U micro USB. Um, yeah. And then this part actually pops up just like that. And these wires, this is the Wi Fi module, so those are very important. Uh, this is a PCIe slot, so you can put other cards into it. And it's very satisfying because there's just like a magnet on it, so you can just like snap it back into place. Um, yeah. And um, also, uh, we have a couple of other things. So, we have this, which is a guide, which it has like a list of all the ports. And then it has like how to like take off this side um, enclosure here. Um, and then here we have a charging so this is part of like the charging assembly so um the charging assembly would be this this uh this brick here this brick and then uh usb c and then these uh three cables um and then this one is a usb c to usb a adapter so that's should be pretty useful yeah and so that's What's in the box? Um, and next, we'll hook it up to an actual computer and uh, do some uh, do some things on it. Yeah. Okay. So here's the specs for the computer, and it would be this column. So we have AI performance of two hundred seventy five trillion operations per second. Um, the GPU is a twenty forty eight core NVIDIA Ampere architecture GPU with sixty four tensor cores. Um, the max frequency for the GPU would be one point three gigahertz. Uh, the CPU is uh, 12 core ARM Cortex A78 AE V8.2 64 bit CPU, um, 3 MB L2 and 6 MB L3. Um, the CPU max frequency would be 2.2 gigahertz. Um, the DL accelerator is 2x NVDLA V2, um, and the max frequency would be 1.6 gigahertz. Um, the vision accelerator is 1 PVA V2. There's no safety cluster engine. And then the memory here is 64 gigabytes, 256-bit uh, LPDDR5 um, at 204.8 gigabytes per second. And then the storage is 64 gigabytes eMMC 5.1. Um, we have video encode here, so anywhere from 2 4K60 to 16 1080p30. The video decode is anywhere from 1 8K30 um, or 22 1080p30. Um, you can have up to six cameras, 16 via virtual channels. Um, here are the, the different uh, uh, ways of connecting them. And then PCIe, you can have up to two uh, times eight, one times four, or and two times one. So that's PCIe Gen 4, root port, and endpoint. Uh, for USB connectors, you have three USB 3.2 Gen 2 at 10 gigabits per second and four USB 2.0. Uh, for networking, you have one GBE and one 10 GBE. Um, and then for this display, you have one 8K60 multi-mode um, DP1.4A plus MST or EDP1.4A or HDMI 2.1. 
Um, other I.O., you have four UART, three SPI, four I, uh, I2S, eight I2C, two CAN, two PWM, DMIC, DSPK, GPIOs. Um, and then the power can be anywhere from 15 to 60 watts. And then mechanical wise, it's 100 millimeters by 87 millimeters with a 699 pin Modex mirror mesh connector and an integrated thermal transfer plate. So you can tell that that's a lot of computing power just packaged into this like uh, this one very small sort of package. Um, and so it's very optimized for edge computing.